star, Ricky Paul Golden. Here's Ricky. freaking stool. Let's uh, talk it over. Uh, How are you, Regent? Yeah. You don't have your boots on, Reed. No, I don't. You got the boots? Oh, yeah. You need some boots. I cannot fit in. That's actually, attitude, this is a little clashing, isn't it? Uh, I bought these boots in the store next door. I have worn them once and cannot get back in them. It just is excruciating. Are they fry boots? What did you buy? What did I buy, Gelman? You were there. You bought them. The Kona. The Kona. Can I just say, is it, are you so big now that people buy your clothes for you? No, 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 no. Gelman was with me when he, he advised me on buying these oh. boots, and they were half a size too small, and they still are. <laughs> this no when you get that, that famous <laughs> one, that maybe. No, no. But you look buff. You look buff. You see, but what I need, what I need is one of these things. What, sure. so you can remember one plus one equals two? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty deep, huh? It would help. <laughs> How you doing? Having a great summer uh, yeah. on Broadway? Yeah. How many performances a week? Eight? Eight shows a week. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. But this is not your first time on Broadway, right? Well, uh, no, it's not. Technically, I, I did a show called On Golden Pond when I was a little kid. But a little I different from Greece. Yes, very. Mm -hmm. you remember, it was a movie, and then they, Henry sure. Fonda sure. and Jane Fonda. Well, who were the stars of the Golden Pond? I mean, on, on, on stage, stage. Francis Sternhagen and oh, Tom sure. Aldridge. Oh, sure. Remember that? Yeah. And uh, the wonderful character actors. But I was like the fifth kid, or the, the fourth or fifth uh, Billy Ray Jr., so I wasn't, you know... And I also didn't know that I was on Broadway. I thought I, I was like a punk. I was 15 years old, and I was down the street playing video games at five minutes to eight, and the stage manager would come and smack me in the back of the head. Say, Get in the Get theater. <laughs> What's the matter with you? And I was like, oh, sorry. So I didn't really know. Now I know. You know? Now Tommy Toon smacks me in the back of the head. Everybody's <laughs> smacking you. It's a great cast. You seem to be having an awful lot of fun. Yes, mm -hmm. we are. Mm -hmm. uh, we, and, and you came to opening night. Was, was it opening night that you... Uh, no, I, no, no, you weren't no, there. That wasn't no. you? No, that wasn't There's another me. weird guy in a yellow jacket. <laughs> <laughs> you were? No. no, but I'm going to come. I want to see... You haven't seen the show? You haven't seen it. Seen Greece, but not... I could have sworn that you saw the show. Oh, okay, well, that's okay. Yeah. But there's one great song in, in the current musical that's missing. Somebody told me... What is it? Um, uh... Bot, uh well, the girl, Beauty School Dropout? Beauty School Dropout's in there. They, we don't do uh, the song that, that Olivia, Olivia Newton-John sang, you, you, Hopelessly Devoted to You. Oh, they yeah. don't have that one? No, way. but I, then you go, oh my God, they don't have that song. But it, you know what? It wasn't in the original <laughs> show, and you don't miss it. And I, I know you go, you don't miss it. She does uh, Since I Don't Have You, which is also, it's, in, it's, out, in the, it's out in the charts now, actually. I think uh, Guns N' Roses sing it, which has no correlation to this. <laughs> and she sings it just like him. So uh, <laughs> no. the act but, actor uh, looks so much like but it, it actually, you don't you don't miss it, and you know you just don't miss it. And besides that, we have like the the songs that you haven't heard before. They're like special treats, if you will, like a little trisket. <laughs> <laughs> what? What are you talking about? I don't now know. you went on a leave of absence from your soap to do this, right? I actually had uh, the show. I mm -hmm. had Greece before I left Another World. Mm -hmm. So um, I was actually working on a show for ABC before I left Another World called Street Match, and that kind of segued into Greece. But my guy, my character, Dean Frame, split and went on a, uh, and it was a rock and roll star. World, world yeah. tour. World, world tour. tour. So, a so I'm, uh, I'm in Micronesia now somewhere <laughs> playing, yeah. here's playing where, club dates. And here's <laughs> where Dean is, right there. Yeah. Oh, man. He's all gone. Yeah. 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a very, Who said that? you know, they look so innocent, Three but they're weird. Today. <laughs> Three o'clock after school. <laughs> And you went to the White House, you met the President? Yeah. And Chelsea. And Chelsea. And Chelsea. Yeah, that's who, the whole first family came into, to the show, it was Chelsea's birthday, they brought uh, Chelsea, a good friend of mine, <laughs> uh, they, ten of her friends, and, and uh, the Secret Service was all over the place, we felt very important, and, and uh, the President came back after afterwards, and met everybody, stayed like 50, I think it was 52 minutes, they, they called it. <laughs> 52 minutes and 13 seconds. <laughs> and uh, he, he, came, he, he took pictures with everybody, yeah. it was like, it was, they were really mm -hmm. wonderful. Hmm. Yeah. That's great. So all right, in a minute now, we've got to come back and sing a song from Greece. All right, we'll be right back. Monday, I was from uh, Greece alone at a drive-in movie with John McDaniel on the piano. Here's Ricky Paul Golden. Sandy, you can't just walk out of a drive-in. 
Thank you. 